Your life is never the same when your child is diagnosed with a serious liver disease. But at Cincinnati Children's, we'll help you navigate the journey. Our Liver Transplant Center is one of the largest in North America. We're experienced in performing the most complex liver transplant procedures, including transplants from living donors, transplants for newborns, and care of children with liver tumors. The war on cancer and cancer in general is the most powerful equalizer I've ever experienced in life. It does not know nationalities, it doesn't know color, it doesn't know religion, it doesn't know demographics, it doesn't know wealth or poverty, man, it gets everybody the mm -hmm. same. At Cincinnati Children's, our specialists are experts in their field and share a passion for applying new discoveries to provide patients with the most innovative, effective care possible. Our approach is a complementary process working with our GI colleagues, with our oncology colleagues, as we try to understand disease processes so that perhaps we don't have to transplant patients, but should they progress and or have disease burden that is not amenable to le a more conservative or non-transplant options, then we're ready to offer transplant. When parents call me or come to our center for our liver program, there is a sense of trust and vulnerability combined and ultimately it ends in a mutual developed relationship. But for a parent to entrust our center and our team with their child's life is something that we take incredibly seriously and it pushes us to want to be better. Because of our role in uh, some international uh, and national trials, um, we have a lot of experience taking care of hepatoblastoma patients, and as a result, we see more complex patients here than we would expect to see in a city this size. It's really our privilege to work with these families. Um, our job is to try to give the kids an option and to help them navigate sometimes difficult situations. The Woolwines came here from Virginia for care for their daughter, Charlotte. The culture here from the administrators right down to the environmental department was world class. I think if we hadn't have been here and had that really like particular attention to detail from every level of caregiver, we might not have gotten to the next step. They had the data, the confidence, the experience, and the technology to make decisions on the fly. They weren't limited to the protocols because they drive a lot of those protocols. Charlotte needed lots of surgeries and chemotherapy cycles. At one point, a liver transplant got delayed after surgery had started because doctors discovered her abdomen was full of cancer cells. Charlotte got more chemo, got back on the list for a liver transplant, and within minutes of getting back on the list, had a perfect match. Everything seemed to turn. Since then, it's been much better. It feels better. Her transplant surgery went really well. Charlotte has been a, was a complicated patient and we're very fortunate that she continues to do well.